Tonight on Live Underground, it is Hungry Hearts. They hail from Fredericton, formed a little over two years ago. They got the raw energy and simplicity of some older classic rock styles, but the urgency of modern alternative music, as well as a nice in-your-face lyricism and attitude of punk and hardcore. Can't go wrong with that. Their album is entitled It's Love. It's an 11-track showcase of the band's signature strengths, solid guitar work, tight drumming, passionate vocal performance of the band. You're going to be able to check them out tomorrow night at Elephant Castle here in town. And their singer, Adam, joins me on the phone. Hey, Adam. Hey, how's it going? It's going well, man. Now, uh, I've got to know, with the name Hungry Hearts, what's the story behind the name? <laughs> well, I get that a lot. Uh, well, basically, one of my favorite artists would be would be Bruce Springsteen, who, who of course has the uh, the song Hungry Heart. Mm-hmm. Um, but uh, that kind of, I, I like the, the name of the song, and that kind of just springs from the idea of just, uh, you know, everyone kind of has the, a hungry heart. Everyone's kind of searching for something, or they're hungry for something. Whether it be you know the certain job they're looking for, uh, you know it could be like marriage, uh, anything like that, right? Uh, just everybody's kind of on the on the on the search for something, you know. So I like the idea of just having a hungry heart. Now I've noticed your your styles. You're definitely taking some influence from some different places, and may, uh, maybe I'm taking a shot in the dark here. But do you guys appreciate Iggy Pop and the uh, the Stooges at all, or? Oh yeah, big time, man! I thought so. As I was listening to your album online today, I definitely got that vibe out of it. Very cool. But I want to know what has been the greatest influence on your guys' songwriting. Well, I think the what's really cool about our band is that we it, like half of the other members are into old classic rock. So you look, you're talking, you're talking like Beach Boys, um, like the Beatles, uh, you know, Tom Petty. Um, but then I kind of bring the more alternative rock, like the sort of like alternative punk rock background. So like. You know, like uh, the Gaslight Anthem, uh, like The Clash, uh, you know, Bruce Springsteen, of course, um, you know, Weezer, those kind of things. Uh, so I think the greatest influence for myself would be Bruce Springsteen, of course, but the other guys, I think they'd argue that it would be the Beatles or, you know, perhaps, uh, yeah, the Beatles, I think, would be pretty pretty easy to say. Not a bad source, really. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> they had a few hits on their hands, so it's a good influence, right? <laughs> Yeah, they did, yeah, for sure. Now you're going to be playing Elephant Castle tomorrow night. What can people expect from uh, your set when they come to see you live? We are, yeah. Um, well, it's going to be a high-energy show. We're going to put on a you know a high-energy show for everybody who doesn't know the songs. They'll be able to at least get into it by uh, watching us go crazy like animals. Um, yeah, I mean, it's just going to be a good, good vibe show, good times, um, you know, easy songs to take in, to digest, Um yeah, it'll, it'll be a good time if you if you come and you know the songs, you know, sing along. If you don't, just come and pretend you know the words or pretend that you're you know the songs and just rock out. You'll have equally as fun of time. <laughs> so, if yeah. want, and, and if you want to check out the full album, it's love. It is online at hungryheartsrock.bandcamp.com. We're going to get to your song Ocean Floors. What would you like to tell me about this song? Well, Ocean Floors is basically. Um, uh, I'm from like a small town in New Brunswick. Called, well, small city actually, Bathurst. Uh, the north shore of, of New Brunswick, and uh, I, I've always liked the idea of, of the ocean. I love I love pirates, and I love like the ocean. It's such a cool thing, and the, I love being in the water. Um, and that's always been something that's really close to me. And then it kind of deals with you know trying to find uh, somebody who's from a different background uh, to you know kind of join that with you. You know, become that part of your life, um, and then kind of mix it together with that, and you have ocean floor. So it's that's basically just about where I'm from and, uh, and finding love and, and weird places. <laughs> yeah. We'll get to that song now. It's Hungry Hearts, Ocean Floors on Live 105's Live Underground.